In this application, we're using the Acuity CL5 white light confocal probe to make a top measurement of a very difficult thinned wall honeycomb type structure. And here you can see we've gone 5 millimeters by 5 millimeters and every 4 microns on the X dimension we've taken a sample and we'd move it down 4 microns and go back across and take it. So roughly we, we took approximately over this 5 millimeter range over 1.5 million points using our white light and this is the software program we're using to show the results. This is the 2D view and of course here you can see if we have our, our little identity card it has basically all the 5 by 5 and, and, it, and it gives our spacing in here. So if we want to let's go ahead and take a look at this 2D view and let's take a profile across it. Let's try that again. Let's go ahead and take a profile across it. And here we're going to see that we are, we're going to go from north to south. And we're going across this segment of the, of the target. And here's a good example. We're, we're going across two of the thin wall sections. And let's go ahead and take a look at those. So here's, that, here's the result of that. And you can see we're right at about a 4 millimeter distance horizontally. And if we want to come and take a look and really see what this sidewall looks like. Let's go ahead and zoom that up a little bit. And here you can see we've got that measurement. And we'll put an absolute scale. So here you can see we can come in and we can actually measure the width of this sidewall. And it's showing that the Horizontal distance is roughly 166 uh, microns across there. And let's take a look at this results in 3D, give you a better visual image of what we're seeing. And, and as you can see, we're getting a pretty good, pretty good target reflections and, and returns of this. And if we want to, we can come in, we can zoom that up a little bit also. And it gives you a very good feeling that we're, that we're able to make this measurement on this top surface. Uh, and I say once again, this is in a bench, a bench testing uh, effort with a very accurate X Y Z stage, and uh, to be determined how this is going to uh, perform online. Um, the sensors will do very well, but we just have to make sure that we can fixture it to hold the accuracy that is required.